world. Captain Mary Faulkner of the All Action Terror Hawk Squad, whose only role in life is to save the galaxy from evil domination. Say good morning, Captain. Good morning, everyone. How nice. Uh, but over here, someone not at all pleasant. The Frank Buff of this setup. She's 140 years old. Her name is Zelda, and she comes from the planet Gook. Are you going to say anything? I don't see why I should. Oh, please. Very well. Bad morning, Earth's come. OK, then, girls. Are you ready? Stars of the day, right? Julie Stephen and all the staff at Albert Baker Limited, Doncaster. Christopher Griffith, Staple Hill, Bristol. Rebecca Malice of Aberdeen. Frida Banks, Kingston upon Thames. Callum Henderson from Elgin. Ray Duff in Horsham. Jesse Foster, Waltham Cross. Kathy Nicholson and the Ladybird Playgroup at South End on Sea. Neil Pitcher from Aston. Joan Stokes and Kelvin from Selston in Nutritious, Nottinghamshire. Hold on to your hats now, starting with Aries. It's time to think of foreign climes and holidays. Consider getting involved in mind-expanding activities that will feed your intellectual appetite. A religious matter may need discussing. Taurus, you're a very emotional wee bull. But why? Possibly because you've really been through the mill recently and want some reassurance that your future looks brighter. Well, it does, my friend. It does. On to Gemini. One-to-one -one affairs have been important for some time now, and yet again you have to make emotional decisions that will affect your whole relationship's future. Your moods are very volatile, but don't take it out on your partner. On to cancer, you feel a little dicky. Either because your working environment isn't as much fun as it should be, or you have worries that you can't seem to fathom out. You will. So don't act so hyper. On to Leo, go out and have a ball. Now a woman will be especially good company, so whether it's a pub or club, get out your dancing shoes, best frock and boogie. Boogie builder? Oh. Well, anyway, a kitty will need care and attention now. On to Virgo. Family matters will fill your day, so don't be surprised if someone wants a shoulder to cry on. It will help resolve recent rows if you're prepared to be a little forgiving and compassionate. Now on to Libra, which is Mary Faulkner's sign, because of her charming nature and her interests in needlepoint and astrology. That's right. I also love gardening when I can find the time. And I paint, of course. Paint? It's as much as you can do to paint your toenails. <laughs> oh, come on, girls. Listen, Mary, here are your stars. Now, Libra, news flies in from all over the place on this very busy Tuesday. Folk will flood through your door, making it like Piccadilly Circus. Try to catch up on your mail and telephone calls. Well, on to Scorpio. Go cap in hand to the right person and you'll get the financial terms you want. In fact, all money matters look fairly bright as long as your intentions are honourable. A little soft soaping will sway even the toughest nut. On to Sagittarius. A lonely moon sits silently in your sun sign, making you feel moody, tetchy and oversensitive. But brighter days are on the horizon if you can control your wayward feelings now, Sagittarius. Tell me, Zelda, what sort of qualities have you got? An honours degree in cunning and deception. The guck diploma in meddling megalomania and malevolence. And all this in a body beautiful. Listen, you sound to me as if you've got all the qualities of a Capricorn. But uh, when is your birthday? Mind your own business, you rotund imbecile. Oh, you cheeky old bint. Anyway, let's go on to the side of Capricorn. Well, I don't think any Capricorn is as nasty as you. On to this then. Trust your intuition, Capricorn, and you can't go wrong. A gut feeling will turn out to be your saviour, as you could so easily fall into an emotional trap unless you heed your psychic warnings. A woman seems to have a rather weird hold over you, so try to sort it out. Anyway, two more signs. Aquarius first. Spend the day with a friend, and emotional ties and hang-ups will be snipped. Sensitive entanglements are not your cup of tea, so try to avoid them today, Aquarius. And finally, Pisces, feelings are fraught on the career front, but anyone who cavorts about hysterically or has an emotional turn will be doing themselves no favours, and that includes you. Some prestige will be lost due to a careless female. Well, that's it, but what's the sign of the day? That's right, it's Cancer, and that's because the sun is fairly prominent in your sign at this moment, and it's time to be yourself, and of course enjoy life, just like Mary and me, and of course Zelda. Hey, I tell you what, 
How's about a song? Would you like to swing on a star? Swing by the neck. Carry moonbeams home in a jar. Who wrote la this garbage? And be better off than you are. La Sentimental la slash. Or would you rather be like her? If I were you, I'd steer clear of the breakfast time studio for another two or, th two or three weeks, Russell, because Frank reckons that that's actionable. <laughs> By the way, you might like to know that the recent fire at uh, Bray, which we mentioned yesterday, did only minimal damage, and work is continuing there as normal. You wait till you come back. Anyway, cleaning other people's dirty shoes, especially when they're still wearing...